And we're back for more Paranormal State Poison Springs. I am your Gibbs, and let's get cracking here. Alright, looks like we need some wood for some reason. So we got seven woods. Got the lights down here working. So yeah, we actually got that generator working in the last episode. Whoa, that's kind of creepy. I think that was another manifestation. Can I use this? No. Alright, so we have a code here. I wonder what Iris thinks is valuable enough to keep in a safe. I don't know. It's a good question. So what do we have here? Looks like someone pulled the handle off. But I have another mitt, so that's good news. So we can touch oveny things. It's missing a light bulb. So, is there one back here? I don't think we can get that one. Uh, we can probably get that one with our newly acquired oven mitt. Yay. Well, it's going to be roasting hot, right? So, better to be safe than sorry. Uh, what is this place? This place is creepy. That is a lock hinge piece. Hmm. The mirror is filthy, but I think I can see something under the dust. So how am I going to clean that dust? We will have to figure that out. Where are the steps? I think I might have them. Just be careful going up there. I'll take that. This door isn't opening without all the hinge pieces. Well, I only have one. So we need to get... Four more. No, three more. No, two more. Two more indeed. Okay, let's see if we can just use this. Alright, so I gotta somehow get some water on this cloth. Hmm. I don't think there was any water back here, was there? Not sure. Uh don't think I see any water here. Now let's look at my map. Where is my map? My journal first. Task list. Find the lock pieces. Yeah, I got it. So you are here, basement two. And we have basement three as well. So where is there going to be water here? Oh, what's this? Oh, a spatula handle. That was over here. I'll take that. Thank you. A putty knife. So... What the heck am I puttying up? Good question. There's gotta be some water around here somewhere to put my cloth in. Oh, I wonder if I have to scrape it. Let's try. Oh. Darn. Okay, so what did it say about my cloth? Wiping it with the with the rag now will only make the mirror uh, dirtier, so it definitely needs to require some sort of uh, some sort of water source. I think. Okay, is there a wolf in here? don't quite see what I'm doing here. Let's find out what the hint tells me to do. Go this way. Okay, so let's think about this for a second. Look for something that's out of place here. Okay, there's actually quite a lot of things that look like they're out of place. Uh, okay, a water pipe. I think I can pry the patch open with something. I happen to have a putty knife. There we go, now we got some water. Now we have a wet cloth. Let's go find out what's on the... Ooh. Did someone just write, don't trust on the mirror? Don't trust who? A code of some sort. Uh, looks like a boomerang, lightning, and a sea. Boomerang. No, oh, wait. Is 
Is that it? Lightning. And this letter C here. No, I must have screwed it up. Oh, I see. It's in reverse order. So, I think. So, I think this one needs to be the... That one has to be... I'll go this way. Oh, there we go. Ooh, somebody's left something valuable in here. All sorts of goodies in there. Ooh, and a hidden object scene too. What did we get there? Ah, oh, we found all the lock pieces. Okay, well, let's go ahead and do the hidden object scene. And then we'll get the heck out of here. Okay. Let's see what we got here. Sports... A sport car. A snowflake. I need something to cut through the tape first. What a piece of glass. Yeah. Okay, cool. Work lock. Whoa, it even goes off. Ding dong. Okay, so what is this for? A scream drawing? I need to complete the drawing. Okay, so that's... Uh, we need a yellow one. Here we go. Those are some old school crayons. <laughs> that was great. Okay, so we have... Oh, look, we have a pair of pliers. Like, go by another name that I like to call it. Oh, wow, that was definitely a jump scare. Okay, so let's see what else we got here. Uh, no, those are calipers. There's a set square. So now we got to figure out where the cat is. Hmm. Could be anywhere, really. Well, not finding it. So it's definitely hidden in here somewhere. Uh, the question is where? I'm not finding anything interactive here. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay, cool. So we have an axe handle. Did we have an axe somewhere? I think it might have been outside. Okay, well, we got the door latches, so let's go take care of that business. Um, move all the latches to unlock the door. Moving one latch may affect the other. Oh, boy. That was pretty straightforward. Hey, look at you. Glad you made it out of the basement, okay? Very impressive. Unfortunately, there's still no sign of Iris. I guess that our best bet for finding her would be somewhere in the museum. Okay, but I want to get the other half of this axe, which... I can't remember where it was. I think it was on a tree somewhere. I just have to figure out which tree it was. No, it wasn't here. Okay, well, I don't remember. I thought I saw it somewhere. Alright, let's go inside. Maybe it was in here. Hello? Oh, uh, hello. Ooh, a Rubik's Cube. Be on your guard. You never know what you're going to find on cases like these. I have to find a way to cover this gap to get up to Iris's office. Hmm. I need wood. So look at what I got here. So, find your way out through the basement. I thought I did that. Uh, let's look at the map. Something important in the parking lot. Maybe that's where that other axe piece was. Yeah, right there. 
I knew it was in a tree. So then the next question is, what can I cut? Something at the bar. So what am I cutting here? This is supposed to be something here. Oh yeah. Wow, I have to hit it a couple times to make it work. It's kind of cool. Yeah, I'll take that giant board. <laughs> it's going to be our big show. Whoa, I hope it doesn't start raining. Or it doesn't start raining? It does start raining? Something like that. Here's our makeshift floor. Alright, let's go upstairs. Oh no! Oh no! Iris! Oh, she's alive. Miss Ramirez, I'm Ryan Buell. Ryan? Sorry to meet under these circumstances. Oh, my back. It... it hurts. How did you get these scratch marks? Scratch marks? Is that what they are? I... I have no idea. Last thing I remember, I was upstairs writing a note to that archaeologist fella, Dr. Walters. An archaeologist? Maybe this Dr. Walters has uncovered something in his excavation that has caused all the recent paranormal activity. Where can we find him? Should be easy in this ghost town. Once into the forest, you'll have to turn right, then left, turn one more time to the left, then go to the right and take your last left. Stay on the trail and you'll be safe. Sergi, I need you to stay here and collect as much data as possible on what's happening here. Lorraine, can you stay with Iris? She looks a little shaken up, and I know that you can keep her safe if the presence comes back. Everybody else, let's move out. Okay, well, we have a map through the forest. That's helpful. So what else can we find here? This place is a great historical landmark. Please help me. People will not visit this place until it's safe. Yeah, I don't blame them. I'm keeping an eye out for whatever caused those scratches on Iris's back. Hmm, I want to get in there. Doesn't look like I can get there yet. A wolf statue. Hey, I thought that was one of my collectibles. No, it's right there. Okay, so we'll come back there, I'm sure. I'm not sure. If... Ooh, we get to do the Rubik's Cube at some point. Looking forward to that already. Alright, let's go back outside. And you had another sighting in the basement? Whoa. I wonder if the spirit is trying to communicate with us. I'm going to head down there and see what messages it has. Okay, well you have fun down there. So we have a map, so that's good. Alright, so it was a right. Two lefts. Although I wonder if there's any wolves in here. Hmm. Could be. Another left. And a right. Uh, <laughs> I think I got lost already. Right, left, left, right. Okay, then another left. There's the sign Iris told us about. Parts of it have worn away. If we replace them, we'll have a much easier time getting around. Fair enough. I think we can probably take care of something like that. There's something disturbing in those signs. Didn't look very disturbing to me, but... Oh, somebody's inside. You are here. I'll take that feather. The map is torn. Well, we found the camping site. Whoa. But apart from this tent, it looks deserted. We're going to interview the workers in the tent. Come check in if you need us. Okay, we'll definitely think about that. Yeah, I found you. Go I can't believe it. I think that people here are actually too scared to talk to us. Maybe... I can help. I have a great recipe for a very soothing lemon tea, but it's in my trailer. 
Okay. You'll need to grab some water out of the well, too. Sorry, I'd help more, but I don't feel safe leaving the tent. Things out there have just been too strange recently. Okay, well, I got a key, so that's helpful. Who's this guy? The archaeologist does not want to talk. Uh, toothpicks. What is that? A photo. Hmm. Alright, so we need some ingredients for this herbal tea, otherwise no one wants to talk to us. Okay, fair enough. Not even the archaeologist wants to talk. Well, we're brave. Let's go. Let's see. Go that way. Wow. A hidden object scene. I love the reflections. Look at that. It's so impressive. Okay, get in there, magnetic key. Uh. Okay. So there's going to be a three in it. So there's a three, a five, and a six in it. Ooh, okay, so that's where the three goes. So we'll try uh, six, three, five, eight. Ooh, okay, cool. Look at that. We got it. Six, three, eight, five. Bingo. Okay, so we can go in there. I want to just take a little peek over here first, maybe. Ah, uh, you know what? We'll just go in here. Wow, that is some dirty old battery. Uh, I wonder if I can just use this brush here. Yeah, there we go. Whoa, it shines! Yeah, now we need a hex key. A battery charger. A recipe for the soothing herbal tea. Hey, what's all this about here? I think this strange lock is missing a part. Hmm. Okay, let's go in here. Wow, look at the hot dogs all hanging there. That's the best. Okay, let's have a looky here. Looks like we need to make a heart. What else can we do here? The tin is closed. Hmm. I need some whipped cream first. Yeah. Tasty cake is tasty. Need to cut that orange in half. What am I making now? Toast. <laughs> it's totally interactive. I love it. This is great. It takes a lot of effort to uh, make it so interactive like they have done here. So I do appreciate that. This is impressive. Every time I see a gummy bear, I now think of Nancy Drew. <laughs> gummy bear theaters. How many of you know what I'm talking about when I say Gummy Bear Theater? Let me know in the comments down below. Okay, so we've got a glass of juice. Gummy bears everywhere. I just want to collect 20 gummy bears. Can I do that? Okay, so we got matches that were here. The herbal tea is in here too. Well, that's good to know. So let's see here, what are we going to do? A shell, and we need somehow to get into the can. Let's think about this for a second. Oh, I see, here was the cake instructions too. So we need a can opener. There it is. Excellent, we found the herbal tea. Okay, let's go back out here. Go forward a little bit. Wow, that is one creepy looking Locked. trailer. We can't get inside. Something is determined to impede our investigation. You think? <laughs> Alright, so what did we get there? Controls, okay. I want to find the wolf. There it is, right there. Alright folks, we're going to take a break here and we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Let me know what you think of the game so far. I'd love to hear about it in the comments down below. Thanks very much. Bye now.